It's Chillmonger. Do you like the lighting in here? I am doing a reaction to Heroes Reborn, the announcement trailer. I know I'm going to dislike it. Ed McGuinness was off of the Avengers to draw this. What exactly is it? Is it six one-part, one-issue things? Is it a whole limited series? Get ready for a rant. Robbie riding the bike. Is that Blade? <laughs> There's like a voice actor going, huh? Coulson. Oh, so yeah, Squadron Supreme type thing, huh? My name is Blade. Two weeks ago, I woke up in a world where no one's ever heard of the Avengers. Uh. Where it's like we never existed. So it's like a what if story. Where Captain America died in World War II. It's the Elseworlds. Where Tony Stark never got trapped in it's a cage. It's not 616. Where Carol Danvers never became a captain. Where Thor never lifted the hammer. <sighs> but the craziest part of all this is that it's that not even consequential to the 616 reality that the main Marvel universe takes place in. You can spend your money on this heroes. story. And I'm talking over his voice. You can spend your money on this story and it will have no effect on anything that happens in stories to come. Knowledge about what happens here is inconsequential. And again, everyone reads the stories for different reasons. I don't do what ifs. Squadron Supreme. The artwork looks good, which makes me mad because I could have been getting this in Avengers. They're doing the Infinity Warps thing. Okay, so it looks like we're not learning from any of our lessons in the past. There's the create new characters argument. Oh, 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 not even that. Okay, so you guys remember all new, all different Marvel, right? We all know what that was, just reskinning. That didn't work. And then they go, okay, what we're gonna do is create new characters, but now we're gonna fuse two existing characters into one. And they did that with Children of the Atom that's coming out. They are doing that, it looks like here now, with Doctor Doom and Colossus are combined. And I don't remember the others. And no, that didn't work. The problem, mainly, that sticks out to me like a sore thumb is when Comicsgate was complaining about all new, all different Marvel. Usually, at least, okay, some people would say at the end of their complaints, just create new characters. Okay? So, why not just create new characters instead of combining two existing things and putting it as one? The problem is existing characters being recycled and repurposed for a huh? That can't keep happening. It's cool when it happens once in a while. Hey, Batman Beyond. Bruce is way too old. Terry McGinnis in. I'm okay with that. I think it's kind of interesting. It's logical. Fusing characters who already exist to create a new thing. Because Doom has an audience. Juggernaut has an audience. That's two audiences that are going to love each other. That's going to love this character. False. Similar to the way Star Wars acts, Lucasfilm employees act. Where they have the moral high ground because of the piece of shit fans. To Marvel, I would like to say this. I don't identify with comics, kid. I actually think they're horrible. However, the people are one thing. The complaints are another. They could be telling you the realest things in the world. The, the, the truest things in the world. And they could be evil as shit. It doesn't make what they're saying not true. You can't keep reskinning classic characters and thinking you're presenting something good we get sick of it we got sick of it we've been sick of it the industry sales have decreased because of it no give me new also when you do give me new don't give me seven agents of atlas and expect me to think that you have a sincere 
dedicated six month plan for all these characters when you don't understood so now don't go too too much of an extreme marvel see this boss i know you watch there's a there's a balance you can put attention and focus on one character make this new character let's use wave as an example make wave appear in an avenger story and then tell your guy who's doing the next big event hey by the way when you do that big group shot can you just include wave we're trying to make it seem like she's part of marvel and is relevant so please put her in there hey guys i'm not asking you to force wave into your stories employees but whenever you do a story having a group shot wave also i need a one or two crossovers who wants to take care of that just one okay okay the iron man book's doing it oh thanks thanks black panther no we don't need you for this one um maybe if you want to plan something maybe eight months but we don't want to do a thing where wave is in 10 different books in one month that's a little bit too strong and uh, people will reject that all right cool there's a balance is that understood no it's not marvel doesn't understand anything